Hello everyone, welcome to this week's episode of The Nick Topic. This week I'll be talking about Nickelodeon logo merchandise. The merchandise that's not any specific Nickelodeon show, just like regular merchandise that says Nickelodeon, I, I think you know what I mean. They made a lot of this merchandise and I'm going to tell you some of what they made and then show pictures. Mugs, hats, pins, baseballs, keychains, bags, watches, shirts, frisbees, pencils, lamps and clocks, erasers, book bags, bowling pins, mini gumball machines, shoes, mouse pads, dog tags, notebooks, a keyboard and an inflatable chair, folders, binders, lunch boxes, towels, pencil cases, cookie jars, rulers, umbrellas, bowls and plates, basketballs, lanyards, sleeping bags, coolers, pillowcases, cups, pencil sharpeners, pens, a mini fridge, birthday supplies, and the list just goes on and on. I do really like the logo merchandise. I don't have much of it, but I buy it when I can. Here's some commercials of the merchandise. Hey, did you know Nickelodeon makes toys and games and stuff just for you? We've got Pink Love Blast Box. Hundreds and Gats. Clone Rain Bender and Pranks to Pack. Videos. Party Goods. Mud. Go Stretch. Don't Hog the Zog Law. Brain Ball Fetch. Nick Magazine Flash Screen. Ah, real Monsters Action. Board games and books for your mind satisfaction. Sneakers, t shirts, games galore. Computer stuff, video games. More and more. Nickelodeon inventing new stuff for you. It's very hard to find this stuff. I do it, I try to find it all the time. And if you do find it, it's really expensive. I usually go to thrift stores to find Nickelodeon stuff. One time I went to a local thrift store where they just like take random things and throw them on the shelves. And I found this Nickelodeon cup for nine cents. It is a little scratched up, but it's okay. I think it's pretty rare. Um, I looked it up and I couldn't find like an eBay listing or a picture and I even like looked at the company name couldn't find anything. That's all I gotta say this week. Uh, sorry if it's short. So on to the news for this week. A few things going on. There is a new glow in the dark um, Reptar Funko Pop. Hopefully a picture will be here. FYE is getting some new stuff. They have Reptar bars. Um, they're like $2.99 each, I think. And they also have Reptar cereal. And I think it releases on November 1st. And then FYE also has a um, Reptar Funko Pop of Reptar cereal, like Reptar holding like a bowl and a spoon. Then this past weekend, the trailer for the Hey Arnold Jungle movie was released. If you haven't seen it, which, how could you not see it? So for about a year and a half at least, maybe, everyone has been told that it was November 23rd that the movie was going to premiere, but uh, apparently it is the 24th, the Friday after Thanksgiving, the day after Thanksgiving. And it's going to air on like Nickelodeon, Teen Nick, and Nicktoons at the same time, I think. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I saw that. And for those who like CatDog, I have a CatDog channel that has everything and anything CatDog, and the link is down in the description below. I hope you all enjoyed this week's episode of the Nick Topic. Make sure to tune in next Saturday for when I talk about Nickelodeon short, purple, and brown. Bye, guys. <laughs>